As a parent, so much of our focus and time is spent making sure our children are healthy and safe. We worry about what they eat, where they sleep, getting all their shots, and who they come in contact with. But healthcare providers should also remind parents of a threat they can't see or hear, a threat that could be hurting their children, lead poisoning. Lead poisoning is one of the biggest environmental health problems facing children in Mississippi. Lead poisoning impacts children more than adults. Children six years of age or younger are at the highest risk of lead-related health problems. Exposure to lead can be dangerous for the developing brains of infants and toddlers. Even low levels of lead in the blood of children can have severe effects. There are various ways young children can be poisoned by lead. They can be exposed when they put their hands in their mouths after touching things contaminated with lead, such as lead paint. Many Mississippi homes built before 1978 contain lead-based paint, so make sure your children don't chew on painted surfaces such as window sills or paint chips. Lead can also be found in the soil children play in. If you suspect that your child is at risk for lead poisoning, please discuss lead poisoning with their medical provider for diagnosis and possible treatment. Contact the Mississippi State Department of Health Lead Poisoning Prevention and Healthy Homes Program for any questions about lead testing or lead poisoning at msdh.ms.gov or healthymississippi.com. You can also visit extension.msstate.edu slash HHI to get a variety of resources, including simple steps you can do in your home to prevent or reduce your children's exposure to lead.